Is, is it too much? Not enough? It's too much, isn't it? Hey, Collector Bros, and welcome to another What to the Box with me, Shinobi Nando. And if you couldn't tell by the Samurai Mask, I'm doing Ghost of Tsushima for the PlayStation 4. Now, as Ghost of Tsushima is basically a game about a samurai that slowly learns the way of the, the ghost, or Shinobi, I just, you know, maybe, maybe just a little excited for this game. Now, luckily, for me anyways, this game doesn't have too many additions, but it does have a few unique collectibles. And I'll show you where to pick them up in this video, all the way from the standard up to the collector's edition. It also has a few unique bonuses. So let's start as we normally do with the standard edition. For ordering the standard version of Ghost of Tsushima, you will get the digital mini soundtrack, a Jin avatar, and the Jin PS4 dynamic theme. Now this seems to be available almost everywhere, as this is just the standard pre-order bonus. There is randomly a launch edition over in North America. However, it is the exact same thing as the standard edition. It comes with the avatar, the soundtrack, and the dynamic PS4 theme. Now, Sucker Punch games have been very, very kind and released the dynamic theme. They normally don't do this too often with dynamic themes, I find. So it's actually really nice that they've released it so you can make up your mind in advance. There's also this standard plus edition, which seems to be exclusive to Amazon here in the UK thus far. The only real difference seems that it comes with a reversible foil, meaning that you can swap the cover art from the standard one to this unique foil one. Other than that, everything else is the same as the standard and launch edition. Now, as always guys, I'll let you know if I find that standard plus edition anywhere else in the comments down below, but as we're getting really, really close to the new release date, fingers crossed it doesn't get delayed any further. It does seem weird that Amazon only has this, but again, this happens quite a lot where Amazon gets like a really, really unique kind of like extra. They did it with Resident Evil. They're doing it with uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. You can check out the other What's in the boxes somewhere? I'm always pointing at the wrong corner. I'm going to just point at both. But anyways, let's move on to the limited edition. The limited or special edition version of the game, depending on your region, comes with the Steelbook, a digital mini art book by Dark Horse Comics, unique in-game items, including the Hero of Tsushima skin set, which includes a golden mask and sword, an extra technique point and the charm of Hachiman's favor, as well as the director's commentary which gives you an inside look from the creative teams and the Japanese historian they use to create the game. This version of the game is available at EB Games New Zealand, Australia and Canada, Game in the UK, Amazon UK and US, Shop2, GameStop EU and GameStop US, and available at Best Buy in most regions. Now in my region, this version isn't too much more expensive and if you don't want to dole out for the collector's edition, I think at first glance that steelbook didn't look too nice, but at a closer look, especially while I was editing the footage for this, the steelbook is actually a lot more detailed than I thought it was. In fact, let's just have, hopefully I can get a closer look right about now. If you're kind of the middle of the road collector, you don't like dishing out like 200, 300 dollars or pounds, then definitely go for the deluxe edition, special edition, limited edition. Um, what was it called again? Also available for those who aren't overly bothered by the collector's edition, but like to collect your art books, there will be a Ghost of Tsushima art book featured here. Be sure to check out the description to find out where you guys can get it. Once again, the art book seems to be done by Dark Horse Comics, which have done plenty of other collector's edition art books in the past, including The Last of Us 2, again, card somewhere. But anyways, enough of all that, let's move on to the collector's edition. The collector's edition version of the game is available once again at EB Games New Zealand and Canada, Amazon.com, GameStop, Game here in the UK, and GameStop EU, excluding Ireland. In this version of the game, you will get the game, the steel book once again, the Sakai mask with Stan, a cloth map, a uh, Sashimoto, uh, which is a war banner, a Furoshiki, which is a wrapping cloth, a 48 page mini art book by Dark Horse Comics. That's a physical one. You'll get the Hero of Tsushima set with golden mask, body armor, sword kit, and horse saddle. Two previous in game items, which is a technique point and the charm skill. The director's commentary once again, and this unique dynamic theme, which once again, Sucker Punch was nice enough to put up on their Twitter which you can see here.
Now, you can have a guess which one I'm going to get. And if you said it was the collector's edition, you'd be absolutely freaking right. If the airsoft mask wasn't a big enough clue, I don't know what was. Hopefully it will fit me as this one kind of squishes my face. This collector's edition is awesome. In my region, it's roughly about 160 pounds, which, which means once again, if we do Nando's math, we take away the base price of the game and we just include the collectibles, that's about 110 pounds. Now that war banner apparently isn't just like a little ditty one, it's, uh, it's, it's full size, but we'll have to see when I unbox it. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Subscribe. Uh, the cloth map is apparently also full size as well as the, the wrapping cloth. Now, whether or not the mask is wearable, I haven't seen or heard if it is. I'll try it on myself. I do have an unusually large head, despite, you know, what my body proportions would say. Otherwise, I am round. But yeah, I'm, I'm, it's a ninja mask. I mean, he's all but a ninja. He's a samurai, but becomes a ninja, essentially the ghost of Tsushima. I'm, I'm excited. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. As always, tell me which version you're going to get. Don't forget, if you're just going for the standard edition, might as well pick up either one of the editions I said for cheap, where you get the dynamic theme, or that foil reversible cover. Give this video a like, especially if you're excited for Ghost of Tsushima, and thank you so much Sucker Punch for actually putting out the dynamic themes on your Twitter so we can show everyone. I hope you don't mind I borrowed it, but you know, it was, you know, fair use. And be sure to subscribe because I'll definitely be getting that collector's edition. Like I said, if the mask wasn't a big enough hint that I'm super excited for this game and, you know, the collector's edition itself. I, I don't know what else to tell you guys. I'll see you in the next video and the next what's in the box or anything else. I'm already disappearing because, you know, Shinobi. Bye bye